I just wanted to tell you guys that my primary reason to quit Google or to resign in Google was not the money. It wasn't any better opportunity as well. Almost everything is similar. Hey everyone, how's it going? This video is in continuation with my previous Google interview experience video where I shared how I prepared for my Google interview, how many rounds I had and in the end I accepted the offer as well. But at the end of that video I revealed that I had left Google at that time and I did not tell you why. So in this video we are going to find out why did I leave Google and where I am working right now. So let's start. So first thing first, where am I working right now? I'm working in Amazon as a software engineer in Vancouver, Canada. So now you all must be thinking because I had a chance to come to Canada, I left Google in India. That is somewhat true, but not entirely true. And let me tell you why. So this is how it all started. So. I went for my Amazon interview in 2020 Feb, so the, uh, my interview with Amazon Canada and uh, I cleared all the rounds and they gave me an offer letter and they started my work permit process as well, my visa for Canada as well. And at that time the COVID happened and my visa was stuck. All the visa offices in India were closed uh, almost through the entire year. so. Just after five, six months of accepting an offer from Amazon, like I accepted their offer in February last year. And after five, six months, I was wondering whether Amazon will wait for me uh, till this COVID thing is over or not, because I was not getting my visa. I was not getting any chance to come to Canada and work here. And without coming to Canada, I could not join Amazon. So if I had resigned at that time, I would be jobless. So what I did is like uh, I got a call from Google. Actually, I did not get a call from Google. I applied in Google through a referral and then I got a call from Google and I went through the entire interview process. I have already, you know, uh, told you guys about my interview experience, uh, the kind of questions I face, the kind of questions you might face, how many rounds I had to go through. So you can just click on here. No, you can click. Uh, you can just simply check my interview experience video here and hope you find that useful. So yeah, uh, let's come back to the story. <laughs> so I got my uh, offer from Google in October last year and that's when I thought of resigning from Salesforce uh, so that I could join Google. Let's not forget that I also had my Amazon offer letter with me and I was only waiting for these visa offices to open again so that I could get my visa. But I wasn't sure if Amazon is going to wait for me for an entire year to, you know, uh, get my visa and then come here. So I accepted an offer from Google as well. And then I joined Google. I informed my Amazon counterparts as well that I'm, I've joined here now. And this was a better position that uh, than what Amazon was offering me. So yes, I joined on a better position in Google and the pay was good. If you compare my pay here in Canada, my pay in India was also extremely good and I was really happy with that. But yes, the visa offices opened again in January this year for us for work permit guys. And I got my chance to go through biometric and all that visa stuff. And in the end, I think at the end of February or in the beginning of March, I got my work permit and visa. And that's when I had to, you know, decide whether I leave Google or I'll stay with Google and leave Amazon. At that time, there were two things going in my mind. I was working for one of the best company on this planet. Everybody has heard of Google and I guess in positive way only. So yeah. If I was telling anyone that I'm working for Google, I was getting a lot of respect and I was kind of enjoying it. So yeah, that was one thing. And the other thing is like Amazon is also one of the good company, of course, compared to Google, Amazon is also pretty good company. 
and these guys waited for me for an entire year in these times so i had to make a decision whether i'll be joining amazon and leaving google or not and we need to keep in mind that my pay is almost similar compared to india i'm going to be you know saving the same amount of money here as well i'm talking about savings not salary here because a lot of things are different here the taxes are high and of course if you earn in dollars you spend in dollars as well so at the end of the day i'll be making similar amount or i'll be saving similar amount after every month and my role is also kind of similar although i would say that my role in google was a bit better than what uh, my role in amazon is there i was part of software engineering here i'm part of it apps uh, there i was working with gcp and salesforce here i'm working with aws and salesforce so yeah i'm still working with salesforce but with other technologies as well but in near future maybe like i would like to you know work more on the core platforms rather than on salesforce but that's the another story so yeah the pay is similar the role is similar but the location was different so and one more thing is amazon was waiting for me as well for an entire uh, entire year so i had to make a choice and that's when you know i talked to my family as well and i also thought about it i always wanted to explore the other side of the world to explore different countries and work there know their work culture and everything so i was getting that chance with amazon not with google and that was one of the key factor for me to decide to you know resign in google and join amazon here for now i'm here for a 3 year work permit and my plan is not to extend it maybe like i'll go back to india after 3 years because i just wanted to explore the other side of the world i don't want to live here i would definitely like to go back to india i love being there i love you know being with my family and friends there so maybe like after some time i'll go back to india but i just wanted to tell you guys that my primary reason to quit Google or to resign in Google was not the money. Uh, it wasn't any better opportunity as well. Almost everything is similar. It's just because I got an offer from Amazon before I joined Google, and so there was some. I had some moral obligations. Plus, of course, uh, I got a chance to explore another country as well. So that's why I joined Amazon here. Now, those of you who are asking me, why did I leave Google? Uh, is it a good company to work for? let me tell you google is one of the best company to work for i loved my time there i loved my team and i loved the kind of work i was doing although i spent very less time there and it wasn't enough for me to explore all their benefits or their work culture uh, i've never even been to a google office because my joining was completely remote and i was working remotely because i joined uh, between covid and i uh, left before the covid was over so so yeah i've never been to a google office but i would definitely like to be there one day for now i'm enjoying my time in amazon and i'll definitely record another video with my amazon interview experience and let me tell you i was interviewed for amazon twice first time for amazon india the second time for amazon canada In the single video I'm going to share my experience with both Amazon India and Amazon Canada and also I'll tell you how to prepare uh, for an Amazon interview how many rounds you'll get and all that stuff so make sure that you subscribe to this channel to get the notification when I'll release that video it will be very soon maybe like just after this video or uh, somewhat in next month So yeah that's about it this is why Katappa killed Bahubali and this is why I left Google so soon I just wanted to be honest with you guys please share this video with your connections and give it a thumbs up if you like my content and subscribe to this channel and stay tuned for my upcoming video I'll see you guys bye bye